Here we are at the corner of Jackson Square, the historic French Quarter. Behind me stands the famous Café du Monde. This year, this establishment will hit its 150th anniversary. It has been a vital part and a cornerstone of New Orleans' tradition and culture. The original stand was established in 1862. It closes only on Christmas Day and when hurricanes threaten. The Fernandez family has owned the Café du Monde coffee stand since 1942. Cool. I, before I came here, I knew that. I just knew the history of this place, that it was old and it was historic. Despite success, the café sticks with its two signature coffees, black and ole. Ole is coffee mixed with hot milk, while black is just your traditional straight coffee. It's a different blend of coffee than your everyday run-of-the-mill Starbucks. And how is that so? It's coffee and chicory. Chicory, root of the, it's the root of the endive plant. The French developed a taste for coffee and chicory during this, their Civil War. Coffee was scarce during those times, and they found that chicory added body and flavor to the brew. It's flavor, and if you heat it and serve it with half hot milk, it tends to give it a hint of chocolatey. The cafe also serves its signature pastry, a beignet. People come from all over the world just for a taste. I've had a beignet before when it was here. It was just like from a restaurant. It was good. So I said, if this is like, you know, the place where everybody goes, I know it's the bottom. This French treat starts with a mixture of flour, milk, and sugar. After mixing, the dough is then placed into a machine that cuts the dough into rectangles. The pieces that pass inspection are tossed in the deep fryer and fried until golden brown. Finally, they are smothered in powdered sugar and served hot to the customers. It's a recipe that has lasted for 150 years. It's the coffee and beignets, that's it. Reporting for J Camp Live, I'm David Liu.